Hello everyone, Kevin Riley here. Hope you're all well. Uh, D-Day Squadron is becoming a formal DC-3 society to organize the interests of enthusiasts, pilots, mechanics, and operators to keep these aircraft airworthy, crewed, and on display for future generations to represent everything that the DC-3 has accomplished in war and peace. Greetings everyone, John Sessions from the crew of Pan Am. We miss all of you. Looking forward to flying some more this summer taking the lead from the Thunderbirds, the Blue Angels, and the Snowbirds. We're gonna be doing tribute flights, both to the medical community and first responders. Looking up into the sky to see these beautiful birds will be an inspiration. Eric Zipkin here with the uh, crew of Placid Lassie. Garrett Fleischman here with Placid Lassie. On behalf of Placid Lassie and her entire crew, we wanted to let everyone know that we truly miss you guys. And we really miss you and we miss being out on the road. Placid Lassie is currently safe in her hangar in Schenectady, New York ready to get back on the road and start flying again. For updates, please check with us on our website at tunisonfoundation.org or on Instagram at tunisonfoundation. We look forward to seeing everyone again soon and hope everybody is staying safe and healthy. Looking forward to uh, getting back out on the road. Hi everyone, Crystal here from the crew of the DC-3 Miss Montana. Myself, the crew, and all of the volunteers at the Museum of Mountain Flying wanted to wish everyone the best during these challenging events. We miss not being able to share the aircraft and the history directly with folks over the last couple months, but we have used this time to make significant changes to the museum, its displays, and making sure the planes are safe and ready to fly when the time is right. Be sure to follow us on Facebook, like and share. We look forward to seeing you soon. Good afternoon. My name is Rod Moyer. I'm flight crew on Dynamic Aviation C-47 Miss Virginia. And on behalf of Miss Virginia's crew and all of Dynamic Aviation, we want to thank you for your partnership, which has been so vital in making it possible for countless people to enjoy these aircraft and learn of our history and the freedoms that we enjoy. I'm sorry that we're not able to see you in person. Lord willing, we will be able to do so again quickly and soon. And until then, you can reach us at dynamicaviation.com on Facebook or Twitter. Hi, I'm Steve Rose with the Commander of Air Force's Inland Empire Wing here at Riverside, California. Last year I had the privilege of being a member of the D-Day Squadron and uh, our mission to Normandy. I got to be the lead pilot on the D-Day doll, a C-53D, which is a combat veteran. Hi, I'm Bill Prosser. It took two and a half years to get ready for the mission. In the beginning, our motivation was to return the doll back to Normandy where she had served some 75 years ago. However, as time moved on, it became very clear that this was not just about returning the doll, but it was that this mission was to be a tribute to all those who sacrificed for the freedoms we enjoy today. Countless numbers of World War II veterans relived, even for just a moment, the experience they had during World War II by interacting with our crew and stepping inside the D-Day doll. Hi, I'm Colonel Tim Terrace, Yapri D-Day Dow, a C-53D Sky Trooper, a World War II veteran of Normandy, Bastogne, in Germany. Hi, my name is Bob Tim Chisholm, and I fly the DC-3, the Flaybob Express, out of Riverside, California. We hope to be flying on Memorial Day around Los Angeles, around the veterans' cemeteries, the veterans' hospitals, in support of all those fallen of the veterans that we need to thank, and for all the COVID-19 frontliners. Hello everyone, this is Jeff Kaufman, part of the Spirit of Benobio. You know, while we might have had the smallest crew of all the airplanes that went to uh, Europe this past summer, we do have a lot of big hearts. And I wanted to thank you from the bottom of my heart for everything that all of our sponsors and that everybody's done for us. The Spirit's doing well. She's up in a hangar in Oregon right now getting an entirely new electrical system. We can't wait to get her back on the show circuit and also out to see all of our friends. Hope everybody is staying very safe and sound and sane during these crazy times. Our hearts are with you, and once again, thank you so much. Hey, this is Nick Camacho from the crew of Betsy's Biscuit Bomber. We just wanted to reach out to all of our fans and supporters, as well as the fans and supporters of the D-Day Squadron, and let you know we're thinking about you, and we hope you're staying safe and healthy. Our airplane's ready to go, and we're looking forward to a strong second half of the air show season this summer. We look forward to seeing you out there. To keep track of our schedule in these changing times, please follow us on Facebook at Goonie Bird Group, Betsy's Biscuit Bomber, and we'll keep you posted on where we plan to be. Good morning, our D-Day Squadron supporters. This is Brandon. I'm here with Liberty, the Legend Airways DC-3. We are 
updating for our season. Obviously with the COVID, we're not doing a ton. We've got all our winter maintenance done. We did a bunch of landing gear, brake repairs from our trip to Europe. She's uh, been flown once and polished once. So she's looking real good and ready for the season. Hello, I'm Kath Burnham, part of the crew of the Happenstands. We're here in Coventry in the UK. Uh, and we haven't been able to get together as a crew for quite some time. We're scattered between California, Alaska and here in the UK. Uh, we'd just like to thank everyone for their support and uh, we look forward to that get together when it finally happens. Hi everybody, this is Andy with the That's All Brother team. We're really sorry to be missing everyone this spring and we look forward to getting back to our touring schedule as soon as possible. That's All Brother is safe and sound in San Marcos, Texas and she's as eager to get flying again as the rest of us are. You can keep track of us in the meantime on Facebook at Commemorative Air Force, That's All Brother. Be healthy, be smart, be safe, and we'll see you just as soon as it's safe to do so. From the crew of the Pipper of Tabitha and May, see you soon. Stay well, stay safe, and we'll see you before too long. Stay safe, stay healthy, and uh, we wish you all the best. Thanks for all the support. Thank you for the continued support. See you soon. Thanks. Stay safe. We hope everyone stays safe and healthy. We'll see you soon. From all of us, thank you for your continuing support. We look forward to seeing you all soon. Looking forward to a better and prosperous 2020. Take care now.